I'll set you free. Yuri! Yuri! Plan to die here? You think it's okay to die? <laughs> Look me in the eye, Estelle. <sighs> and they were never heard from again.
guess we don't have a choice. Estelle, I'm sorry we have to hurt you. What the hell do you think you're doing? I... I... No! No more, please! Do you really plan to die here? You think it's okay to die? Ah! Hey, look me in the eye! Estelle! Estelle, step out of it! Come back to us! Estelle! Ah. Are you just gonna let your life end like this? Like someone else's tool?
You did it, Estelle! You're you again! Wait! The system! It was being kept in check by Alexei's sword. Without that... Uh... Ah! I can't... I can't stop it now! Everyone, run! Don't worry! We're not gonna lose you! I might be able to use his system. Amazing. It's synchronized with Estelle. Interference deactivation data. A formula to isolate surplus air. But what could possibly take the place of the Apatheia? What about this sword? This is the original that Alexei based his on, right? Let me try it. Let me help. I'll keep track of the flow of air. Me too! I'll help out. Oh, damn this useless body. Please! Everyone! What did I say? We're not gonna lose you. When Brave Asperia does something, we do it right. Okay. Welcome back. Nice to be back. The Enduring Shrine of Zaude. That's what he said. Have you heard of it? No, that's the first time. I wonder what it is. I don't know, but I know what he's gonna use it for. Moral domination. Do you really think he can do that? He sure thought he could. We knights are always one step behind. We never would have been able to free the capital if it weren't for Yuri and the others. Much less stop the Blastia from spreading this danger across the land. It was the knights that protected the capital from Heracles, though. They're the only reason we were able to even get into the capital at all. Even with Lady Esteles. Hey, Estelle came back on her own. I'm still grateful, though. Thank you. Quit it. You're creeping me out. Alexei owes the world for all he's done. He owes us. Tomorrow, I'm going to the Shrine of Zaude. I assume your friends will be with you. Yeah, everyone's resting up for tomorrow. So spare many guilt trips tonight. Okay. Captain, so this is where you were. <sighs> Negotiations with the Union are difficult. It seems they can't even agree with each other. And one more thing. The Council intends to cede all authority to His Highness Yoder in order to control the current crisis. Due to your success in liberating the capital, His Highness has pronounced you Acting Commandant! Congratulations! Well, this cleans up one of our problems. Congrats. Watch your tone! Yuri, you're the one who really did all this. 
Ah, uh, details, details, whatever. Well, I guess I'll go check on the others. See ya. What's up, Carol? Oh, Yuri! Take a look! It's as good as new! Good to see you're as useful as ever. That's not yours, though, is it? It's mine! Thanks! This boy's been fixing up all the stuff that got knocked around in that commotion. He even went back to the lower quarter to pick all these things up. <laughs> Actually, Repeat found most of it. These are my favorite shoes, and you can't hardly see where they got torn. This guy's awesome. He sewed up a dress that was very important to me. Thanks again for that. Are you sure about doing this, Carol? Tomorrow's the final battle. It's okay. I was actually a little worried. I couldn't really sleep anyway when I started thinking about the battle tomorrow. I just thought I might as well help out if there was anything I could do. <laughs> I didn't think Rapide would want to come help, though. I was a little surprised. He probably guessed what you were thinking. He doesn't just go along with anything. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> well, don't push your luck. Ah, oh, come on, Rapide. Oh, this boy's got a bright future ahead of him. You are looking at the esteemed boss of our guild. You might learn a thing or two from him yourself, you know. I walked right into that one. Memories support the heart, and our dearest possessions are the vessels for those memories. Thank you, young man. I'll just do a little more, and then I'll call it a night. Okay, just don't overdo it. Yeah, I know. Thank you. 
He's actually sleeping. Man, I can't tell if he's brave or just stupid. Weren't you gonna have a touch and reunion with your bestest pal? No, it's that lieutenant of his. Ugh, she's scary. Hmm? Oh, well, I guess I can see that. What do you mean? Ah, huh, well, it's just... she's so serious. Gotta be careful not to rub her the wrong way. I'm not rubbing anything any way. Well, you most certainly can't please all the people all the time. <laughs> I guess you're right. So what are you doing here? Oh, just thinking about stuff. Hey, why are you looking at me like that? With all we've been through, I guess I'm just trying to figure out what I should do with myself. But I keep coming up empty. Change wears me out. You chose your own life. At this point, you should be able to do anything you want. How do I put it? I already died once. Now I'm thinking about a bunch of stuff. But I guess thinking about settling things with Alexei is enough for now. The rest will probably come out in the wash. That sounds okay to me. Speaking of settling things, I filled Estelle in on all the stuff that happened. Guess what she did? Hmm? She said I had to let her do the same thing everyone else did. So she smacked me on the head, called it even. <laughs> That's Estelle. It kind of hurt, actually. Well, I think I'm gonna catch my shut-eye in here. Suit yourself. Try not to oversleep for once, though. bring the value back down, so the discrepancy with this should... <sighs> nope. It's nowhere near enough. Yuri! What are you all doing out here? Shut up and leave me alone! Nice to see you too. So what kind of experiment is this anyway? Is something wrong? No, it's being kept well under control. And it's stable. As annoying as it is to admit, Dane Nomos and the system of Alexei's are both pretty amazing. So then where's the problem? The effective area of control is more limited than I thought. The control barrier originates at the barrier Blastia. She's stable inside it, but she can't leave. I guess Dane Nomos alone couldn't take the place of all those apatheia. So long trips are out of the question. Also, the barrier Blastia is part of the system. As long as it's in use, this city is defenseless. That's why I'm out here trying to figure out a way for her to move around freely. Why can't Estelle just take Deinomos with her wherever she goes? It was really only designed to contain air that's gone out of control. I don't think it could actually affect Estelle in any way. I guess that's how it was with Duke, too. Don't worry. I'll come up with something. Or my name isn't Rita Mordio. I won't let Estelle wind up trapped like that again. Nobody treats my friend like just some thing. Okay, I'll leave you to it. Nothing to worry about. You've got the best genius under the sun with you. Yes. I know Rita can help me. I'll have this ready by tomorrow. You get yourself to bed. Okay, okay. Don't push yourself too hard. Same to you, Estelle.
What are you doing, Judy? I'm trying to see if I can contact Pharaoh again. If Zauda is connected to the ancient catastrophe, Pharaoh might know something about it. Isn't he gonna ask about Estelle? I'll tell him it looks like everything will be okay. All right, thanks. You know, the only real goal I've had in life has been to destroy the Hermes Blastia. I didn't have to think about other things while I was doing that. Other things? Oh, this world, me, lots of things. Had I never met Estelle, I might still be flying around with Ba'ul, not thinking of anything. Pharaoh said you'd change too. Don't get me wrong. I'm telling him Estelle will be all right because I really believe it. I have no intention of ignoring the Blastia or the air. Is that part of the lots of things you mentioned? <sighs> Sorry, forget I said that. I won't kill Estelle. Nor will I let her be killed. I also can't let Alexei go on. Okay. We head out tomorrow morning. Just get back by then. Understood. Judy. Hmm? Let's win this one. Okay.
doing wandering around? I'm making sure you guys aren't causing any trouble. I see. You're wandering around so you can cause some trouble. Uh, no, I said... Uh... I'm so glad that Estelle's back. And that we didn't have to kill her. Yeah, I feel the same. If we hadn't been able to bring her back, would you really have killed her? Why do you ask? Because... I don't know, is what I'd like to say. But if Estelle hadn't heard my voice when she did, I probably would have killed her. How can you go to such lengths knowing it's going to hurt you? Estelle's my friend, and I can't let a stranger take care of my friend's problem. Besides, I'm not the one who it hurts the most. A friend's problem? Yuri, you're really strong. Strong, huh? I don't know about that. But what about you? Did you forget your search for the Maristella? Right now, I'm focusing on beating the bad guys. Besides, I haven't forgotten. If anything, I've got a great memory. A great memory, huh? Uh, What's wrong? Yuri, I... I'll never forgive Alexei. Sacrificing someone for his own desires, I could never forgive that. Yeah, I know what you mean. That's why... Um... We can't let Alexei get away with what he's done. No, he can't. Oh, right, Yuri. Guess what? The Maritime Guild, Gulsong, is rushing to fix our ship. Gulsong? Isn't that Tokunaga's guild? Yep. We'll be able to use the Fiertia in no time. All right, then we'll use that to take Alexei down. Of course! So, uh, Yuri? Patty. Huh? If you're having difficulty saying it, there's no need to force yourself. I'll listen when you're ready to talk. So go get some sleep. Good night. 